Patients at about 50 medical centers. Incredible. Caffeine, Viagra, not exactly something you'd give a child, but that is exactly the treatments that doctors use to save the lives of many of the 450,000 preemies born every year. CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez shows us how the unusual treatments work. The day she was born, Autumn Tackett weighed less than a pound and a half. Born at just 26 weeks, she was fighting for her life. When we came here, Autumn was really struggling to breathe. Um, she was really struggling to keep the fluid off of her lungs. Today, Autumn is getting stronger, and the medications that helped her may be surprising. Dr. Edward Shepard is chief of neonatology at Nationwide Children's Hospital. He says one of the more common therapies used in preemies is caffeine. Essentially, giving these babies the equivalent of a cup of coffee can have remarkable results. We think it stimulates the diaphragm. We think it helps to stimulate the lungs, um, but most importantly, it stimulates the brain to remind the body to breathe. First reaction was, I'm not allowed to drink it while I'm pregnant with her, but you're all going to give it to her. <laughs> Very surprised. Even more surprising may be giving babies the drug Viagra, but doctors say it's been shown to help a life-threatening condition known as pulmonary hypertension. That's where it's too hard for their heart to pump blood through their lungs. And this medication actually works to relax the lungs so that the heart doesn't have to work so hard. It's something that you wouldn't imagine being used for a baby, but it's truly helped her out tremendously. One in nine babies in the U.S. is born prematurely, which is before the 37th week of pregnancy. But they're not the same as tiny adults or even small babies. That's why doctors have to specially modify medications for use in preemies, including adult drugs for high blood pressure and even heart failure. Dr. Max Gomez, CBS 2 News. And another adult medicine used to treat a heart problem in preemies is the painkiller ibuprofen. Now, there are preemies and then there are newborns who are just a little